Now we're moving on into the arm bar from the close guard. Let's look at it. I'll show it one time first. So here's the details, right? Again, I'm looking for a punch grip on this side and notice I'm closing my elbow, keeping this very tight to me. The other hand is going to always swim under his arm and try to reach as much as you can all the way behind the elbow, right? Now, I am looking to move the arm across the hip. Sometimes might not have the strength, so I'm just kind of bouncing the arm across, right? Now, this is going to consist of either pulling the shoulder. Personally, I like to reach behind the head to sort of bring my middle finger inside the armpit here so I can keep them stuck. Now, it's about creating the angle, right? So, my head is going to pivot to the same direction that his arm is pointing to. So, I bring in my foot to his hip, and this is going to be a huge help that's going to allow me to skip my hips out, and then I'm going to climb my other leg right underneath his armpit, putting weight on his back. Now from here, I'm going to block his face away and string my leg out so I can bring it over his head. This leg is very important that I make sure I bring my heel down, other one as well, but I'm trying to keep his face away from the submission. Right? If not, he's going to lean all his way to me and stack me, not allow me to finish it. Now that I have this secure, make sure your knees are pinched, control the arm, thumb pointing up. I'm going to bridge my hips up to hyperstand his arm. One more, different angle. Last one. 